parade, another bloody negotiation. Smiles, everyone. We must be careful how we present ourselves. Why did Divine Victoria call the Exalted Council? She's kept Orlay from bothering us for the last two years. At increasing political cost, yes. She has done all she can, but the Exalted Council has become necessary. Orlay would control us, and based on their many marriage proposals, they have specific plans for you. Our real concern is Ferelden. They would see us disbanded entirely. Inquisitor, it has been too long. I hope the years have been kind to you. How have you been, Mother Giselle? I spent last summer in Empresse du Lyon, distributing food sent from the exalted plains. The Dales are finally recovering. Since Corypheus fell, I think you may have spent more time traveling than I have. It keeps me out of trouble, Your Worship. I should mention that your forces at Suladin Keep were of great help. Please give my compliments to Baron Deschedin. Divine Victoria asked me to greet you on her behalf. She is currently attending to the Ferelden Ambassador's concerns. I haven't seen Divine Victoria as much as I'd wish these past few years. She has missed you as well, Inquisitor. There are few with whom the Divine can be herself. I suspect the same is true for you. Duke Cyril will wish to greet you on behalf of Olay. I believe he is currently speaking with the Tevinta Ambassador. Many of your friends have returned as well. I hope you have a chance to speak with them before the Exalted Council begins. The Imperium sent an ambassador. Yes, Your Worship. Dorian Pavas has taken the chance to return from Tevinta. It will be good to see him again. I owe him my apology. I allowed my distrust of Tevinta to cloud my judgment. He took a great risk coming to help us, and deserved better treatment. You're going to apologize? To Dorian? I have little patience for those who cannot admit they were wrong, Your Worship. Myself included. I will have to make my apology somewhere public. He will want an audience for his reaction. Who has returned for the Exalted Council? Your dwarven friend, Master Tetras. For one, I understand he spent much of the last few years in Kirkwall. I believe Sir Blackwall has returned as well, although he now uses the name Tom Ranier. Enjoy time with them while you can, Your Worship. I doubt you will have a chance once the Exalted Council is underway. Thank you, Mother Giselle. Your Worship, a final question, if I may. This Exalted Council... Thorelden would have the Inquisition disband. Olay sees its power as another feather in a Chevalier's helmet. What do you wish to do with the Inquisition? The Inquisition still has work to do. We can't let someone's fear push us into disbanding. Then I wish you luck in the negotiations to come. Make a watch over you, Inquisitor. I will not keep you any longer. Fashionably late. I thought you weren't gonna show. <laughs> I'm late, and you decide to make the Winter Palace rubble. Eh? Never liked it anyway. Too fancy. So tell me everything that happened while I was away. 
And after the betrayal, and what I put those men through, my sorries were worth about as much as shit. Are you glad you at least tried to apologize? It's hard to say. I go back and forth most days. They needed to know that there's a way to come back from anything. And I wanted to help them if I could. I thought going up there on the gallows was difficult. This was worse. A hundred times worse. Anyway, it's nice to be back. Though I'm not sure what to think of this council. No matter what, you know you can always count on my sword arm and my friendship. If that's your sword arm, I think I'm better off without it. Think you can do better. Inquisitor, I see you have time for afternoon refreshments. Glimmering, glittering, perfect cut, mask, a maze of gemstones. She will think it pretty. Excuse me, I might... Um... You're useful to have around, Cole. He wants stones the color of his eyes. Happy, bright, beaming, being seen, not seeing. And I needed the table. For breadcrumbs? Birds like breadcrumbs. Inquisitor, how good to see you here. I came to sit and pen another song. Sweet songs, poignant pain plants joy that grows later. She can't see me. I help her help people. I gathered. You're smart and kind. You're worthy of true love. Hello, Halam Sharam! The fire of Zither must be fueled by wine, ideally shared with adoring fans. It's a mistake, but one you might enjoy. The famous Zither. I love all your songs, although I've never heard you sing yourself. Well then, this could be a chance for both of us to make a little music. Nicely done, Cole. Here's you, and everyone. Glad to be back all stuffed together, with the pressure full on, again. Don't worry, Herald of Everywhere. I came prepared. I know what everyone needs. Just like best times. I expected a roof. It's early. Anyway, that was a good run. It's all been a good run. I needed that. And I need... You know it's ending, right? We can say it won't, but knobs in places like this. All they do is end things. They'll try a leash. Or worse. But maybe you aren't ready to quit just because some Lord Piddlebits is scared of us. The Inquisition's still needed. No one can question that. That's the problem. When people need us, they don't need them. Point is, sooner or sooner, all this changes. And you've helped me understand. Too much. So it's my turn to help you have these friends. And all of them were the wrong sort of whatever. Their place changed, or it never was. So together, we made an us. Everyone needs an us. And when the world is done saying no and calls you the wrong sort of whatever, maybe we can be that us for you. What do you think, Inquisitor? Want to run some rooftops as a Jenny? You want the Inquisitor? Don't I have a few more titles than your usual Jenny? No offense. Some taken. Pfft, words. Look, we don't want you. We want to be there for you. 
If you want to keep doing, it won't be nobles who help. It'll be friends. Well, all I have to say is call me Red Frigging Jenny. Way too confusing. You'll get a city. One that rhymes with arse. Oh! I should have said we needed a we instead of an us, because... <laughs> Wait! Anus! <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> uh, to all my friends. Always and ever, Inquisitor. Always and ever. Sarah was never in the grip. Creepy song is creepy. Blah. Hey, boss. Yo, DJ, put a nigga back to the record, baby, and give me this shit right here.